This is just a very small peak of the iceberg, but the problem is really huge and we are not defending ourselves. Ludek Niedermeyer of the EPP Group, a Czech member of the European Parliament's Special Committee on Financial Crimes and Tax Evasion. This hearing focused on money laundering cases involving Russian individuals and their effect on the EU. This can, for example, trigger the real estate bubbles and at the end people have to pay too much money for, for the living. The money can be used for financing of illicit uh, activities like undermining our society. Among those attending was Bill Browder, an American businessman whose lawyer, Sergei Magnitsky, was beaten and died in a Russian prison after uncovering massive financial fraud in the government there. The Russians use this money to corrupt the political process. They pay politicians. The Russians use this money for what I call black ops. They put this money into criminal networks. Effectively, by having this money, um, Russia can achieve all sorts of uh, geopolitical goals. Niedermeyer backs calls for all EU member states to enact the so-called Magnitsky Law, which imposes sanctions on people linked to financial fraud and human rights abuses. We have seen that out of 200 million uh, dollars in Magnitsky case, they were able to detect a few millions that ended up in pocket of concrete people that can be subject to sanctions. If we do it as the union uh, together, then obviously we are such a strong power, we, we can afford to build effective and strong, uh, strong defense measures against such a wrongdoing that are undermining our society.